Jenna, yes, we are here again with the series uh, Björnstad or Bear Town in English. We just came out of the review for the series. So if you haven't seen that yet, uh, watch it on our channel. But in this video, guys, we're going to take a look at the differences between the book and the series, because you see it here behind me, the book, I read it. And there's quite some differences between this book and the series, which might have added to the series, might, may, might have made it a little bit uh, uh, better. So we're gonna take a look at those. For the people watching that don't know us yet, my name is Bas, streaming from Stockholm, Sweden. I am from the Netherlands. These guys here with me are also from the Netherlands, but they live, well, in Amsterdam, the Netherlands, and in Romania. Uh, we talk on the channel about series, about movies from all countries and, and, and everything. So if you're interested, don't forget to subscribe. But let's dive now into those differences. Uh, guys, to start with, well, I already touched on it in our review, but there, a lot of the characters are much more developed in the book, which makes sense. I think that's with everything that is being made a movie of a series out that, that started out as a book. But for example, the characters of uh, Anna, Mira, Ahmad, Zacharias, Bobo, Benji, the bartender, Ramona, they are basically uh, uh, all characters that are much more uh, developed in the book. So... I do really recommend you to read the book because then you get a much more story about those characters, which you know, makes it also much more layered. Mm -hmm. uh, but most notably is the character of David. And David is the guy who plays the well, assistant coach, but young guy who's the assistant coach of uh, Peter. And he uh, plays, well, he's maybe one of the leads in, in, in the book, you could say, okay. because in this book, he is actually the head coach of the youth team and not Peter. Peter is the technical manager of the club and right. it is uh he's never involved with the youth team himself and it is david who is the coach of this team um and what you can see is that they combined the character of david and peter more or less in some scenes because it's also david who doubts the story of maya that she comes with and not peter the father himself so they combined scenes of uh, of that but so, david, uh, david also doubts it though yeah, David also doubts it. Yeah, that's okay. that's, that's yeah. true. Yeah, but uh, that was interesting to see. I didn't realize it when I was watching it, but then later on, I I I, I read the book again, and then it turns out that uh, well, Peter was never the coach of the team, which of course changes the things a bit because yeah. Peter had almost a bit of a fathership relationship with with those guys in the series. Yeah, yeah and especially with Kevin, the the perpetrator. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. So because I, I've even the some hours before or the day before they came, he, Kevin came to the house of Peter uh, to give him yeah. a hug and to thank him for the support. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, Kevin was really opening up because he didn't have like a warm, uh, honest father he could yeah. uh, who was supporting him, although he was the best player of the town. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Because his father was uh, had yeah had a lot of. Well, issues with himself <laughs> he was projecting on his son yeah. and uh so that was actually also i found i found that also really strong uh ingredient yeah that uh yeah also did not really continue on in the in the series like after i mean they i've seen they've seen each other once uh or twice and, and yeah. once was they, they he was attacking him at the police station yeah, that was all. I think in a book you could work that out uh, probably much better. I don't know how how that went. Yeah, that was a bit more a bit more worked out. I can't recall completely uh, uh, how it went, but of course it was more worked out. Though I I do think they put more emphasis on it in the series uh, to maybe dramatize, of course, a bit like also having him come at the at the home and th that that relationship was a bit bit less. Uh, prominent in the in the book uh the relationship of david the coach with david had a very close relationship with all those boys and that's what really gets touched on in this book the relationship of david yeah. with those boys and also david uh, who, who becomes a father in the book uh, and is struggling also with what well, he has to believe and whatnot and also starts to realize how he has well maybe took the wrong approach and uh, yeah there's a lot of character de development for him while in the book in the series of course he's more or less a bit of a minor minor character there's not so much to him he's mostly mm. just a bit annoying always annoyed guy but mm. uh, so yeah that was interesting okay 
Something so, yeah. else you 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 read? What was yeah? Well, we we have uh, another difference is that in the series, uh, the family of Peter, Maya, and the son and Mira they arrive at the beginning of the series in the town after being away for a long time in the U.S. In the book, actually, they are already back for 10 years. So they are already living in Bjornstad for 10 years. Uh, Maya, for example, is already befriended with Anna for a long time, uh, while in the series they just arrived back. So that's, yeah. that's uh, a major difference. I found uh, that actually a, co a good part then of the TV series because it gave me really the feeling that they were uh, well, uh, more globalized people. Uh, yeah, he, he, he played in the NHL, uh, yeah. the father and the coach, and he came with his family back to his his, his town yeah. where he grew up, and it gave also this feeling of contrast. Especially the mother, uh, mm -hmm. you feel that she was not really uh, getting grounded in this yeah. town, and uh, it gave also some critic, uh, yeah, some some view from outside on this small town uh, culture where, uh, yeah. That that can be sometimes yeah. uh, suffocating. And I think in the end, because I think in the book, it also comes across very well what you just said, those things. Uh, but there they're already back for 10 years, but they're still struggling with it. So in the book, it's they're already back for 10 years? So they... For 10 years, yeah. yeah. Uh, why, why they made so many changes, actually? So yeah, I think to to not what often is the case, of course, with series and movies that are based on a book, to not have to explain too much. Like, okay, if they have been away for ten years, you have to create more backstory, maybe. While okay, they're just back okay. now, and we take it from here. Like that's of course an easier uh, storytelling technique than than have them already be back a bit more dramatic also of course like okay they're coming back to this town how do they, go, do they cope well in a book you have much more time to flesh it really out uh, yeah, I, yeah, I think yeah. also true yeah so in this series uh, we touched on this already in the review in the series uh, kevin tells maya that his mother is not really his mother but his stepmother and in the book she really is his mother um, and she is actually the one that finds the blooded uh, clothes after the rape and mm -hmm. she also finds a button of Maya's shirt. And from that point on, you see in the book how she is struggling with how she, well, uh, deals with this, with her son. She has the feeling that their son did something, but oh. uh, you don't want you don't want to rat out your son. So she gets rid of the evidence, actually, but she struggles very much with it in the book. And in the end of the book, she goes to Maya to apologize for everything uh, that, that happened. And that's more or less the uh, end of the story. Yeah. Card. I think they really did it on purpose not to make a set model because not to have to add a layer to this, of course. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. But still show it a bit because you still see her a bit struggling when she's listening to the two. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, yeah, but she, she, just, she just walks off and I found that a bit like, okay, she doesn't say much, but yeah. yeah well, we but she's also married to the guy, so yeah, you know. Like, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And we touched on it in the review. It would be another theme or another thing that they would have to explain so in that matter it's maybe better that they kept it out but i found it a very interesting theme like how do you deal with it as a as a yeah. mother if you know your son did something horrible yeah. um, but uh, so yeah there was a there was a difference um then in the series it is hinted at that Ahmad really likes maya or likes maya but in the book to me oh. at least it became much more clear because Ahmad has been in love with maya already for years and to me that okay. adds a bit more to the story well the triangle more or less between kevin Ahmad, and maya uh, i missed that a little bit in the series uh, you could see in the beginning just the look that he liked her a bit but it was not yeah, super not clear. so clear no not so uh, no not so no. Clear, actually. Uh yeah. I well yeah. Okay, it it was not spoken out, you mean? Nay, nay. Yeah. No. Nay, okay. in the book it's really clear that the order is for years has a crush on uh, of course there is a difference because they now arrived in the series, they arrived just back in town, so that maybe yeah. makes it already more difficult to uh, play with that. Uh, yeah. while in, in the book they are already there for a long time and he has a crush on her for a long time. Probably yeah. they, they worked out also um uh Benji. Yeah, well, that's what I touched on in the review. In, in this in this book, the storyline of, of Benji struggling with, with his sexuality is much more uh, developed, which I find a bit of a missed opportunity in this series because I think it's an important theme to talk about, sports and, and sexuality. Yes, uh, yes. Especially in a locker room like that. And especially, really when, especially with this masculinity uh, uh, exactly. sports, like football, ice hockey. Yeah. yeah. And this kind of town also like it's only like bear town literally. They're like yeah. a whole bunch of bears in a way, you know. Like 
Yeah, that's guys. also yeah, that's what they say yeah. in the book. Yeah, that's what they touch on in the book that they say like he's raised by three sisters, uh, Benji more or less, and they touch on it like hockey is all he wants to do and those guys are everything for him but it makes also that he has to shape himself in what they want him to be yeah. uh, and that's very powerful i think in the in the book which uh, well doesn't it's just a bit like touched on in the series but really not really developed uh, which i would have liked to see a bit more yeah yeah i can yeah but yeah that's that's also a, um, a matter of making decisions eh? we just discussed in the review that the yeah. director he got only five episodes and he actually uh, had too much to tell and huh? yeah. that can also yeah. maybe he should have decided to leave this yeah. whole thing out with benji because yeah but then then people would have would have been upset i think yeah that, that people say like oh you don't want to touch on yeah. sexuality and uh, yeah, yeah. Cool. yeah because now yeah. now 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 it was just yeah he pointed the finger on it but it was not yeah. work, worked out i mean no, right. no. He, right. or, or or maybe he should have done that not that he got in argue with his uh crush because uh yeah. he came out of the hospital and then there was suddenly this argue yeah. and uh he let the viewer really guess about uh yeah there was what, nothing built up to that actually there was no and also no after like uh right, that's what i mean yeah so i think yeah th then you better can say uh, leave it yeah yeah because now he he, he <coughs> assumes that the viewer uh, knows his inner battles, but yeah. uh, that, that wasn't spelled out. <laughs> no. Exactly. And um, well, one other thing was uh, what what I did really miss in this in this uh, 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 series is the moment when when the rape actually happens uh, in the book. Well, in the series, oh. we see Ahmad opening the door. He looks into the room. And then he walks away, if I if I remember correctly. But for me, it was not super clear that he really saw that there was a rape going on. It's, it's it, for me, it, it looked like me that, that he could also think like, okay, they're having they're having sex, so yeah. to say. Um, yes. And, yeah. yeah. I, I, and I, I missed because that. He, yeah, because he he watched in the eyes of Kevin, uh, yeah. the perpetrator, and he couldn't see, uh, but he no. knew she was there. But he couldn't see her. She didn't see Ahmad as well. Nee. Or neither, neither. I mean, uh, yeah. so he could not see if she was enjoying or uh, suffering. Yeah, that was also nee. a bit weird. Exactly. Yeah, true. And yeah. I think that's what the series suffers a bit from because this is the, the pivotal point. And that way you can say maybe that's director, directorial, not, not greatly done. Because in the book, it is Ahmad who walks into the room. He clearly, with his inner thoughts, you see that he clearly sees that she's being raped. This is the moment that Maya uh, finds the chance to, well, uh, get herself freed from Kevin and then runs out of the room. Okay. Uh, Very different. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Ahmad goes after uh, Maya, who runs outside. Ahmad goes after her, shouts her name, and asks asks her what happened. He's he's crying, Ahmad, and he tells her that that she should talk to the police. And Maya says that no one would believe her. So that gives much more depth, I think, to that relationship already between yeah. Ahmad, Ma yeah. uh, Maya, and and Kevin, which I think the series would have profited uh, from. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nope. And the yeah. same the same thing counts for Benji actually because Benji comes at one point from the uh, cafe where he meets with the boy. Uh, he goes with the car with his sister, and in the book he sees something on the road and he he asks his uh, sister to stop the car and he sees Maya and he sees that Maya is 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 hurt is upset something happened mm -hmm. to her but he sees Maya hiding behind the tree that she doesn't want to be seen uh, Benji mm -hmm. knows that feeling uh, keeping a secret so he decides to leave her but from yeah. that moment on he knows that something happens and that Kevin uh, uh, did something to her and that's also not really clear in the series, uh, which would have added, I think, also pretty much to it. Yeah. 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 Uh, to come back to your 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 first example, uh, because that the the director made another uh, interpretation. Uh, he decided that only Kevin knew that Ahmad was going into the room, so uh, okay. he could. Uh, why? Okay, you don't know this. No, yeah, yeah, but, yeah, but you did you 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 know that that is the uh, interpretation because it was to me not clear that only. Ah. Well, I think it was hundred percent clear that uh, the family of Kevin knew that Ahmad uh, came in the room because yeah, Kevin told, told his father, and then his father tried to buy Ahmad out to yeah. shut his mouth. Yeah. And 
the family of Maya and Maya herself didn't know Ahmed was there. In the show, yeah, exactly, yeah. yeah. That, that all came out at the... The the meeting. The, the meeting of the club where all yeah. the all the all the families were yeah. all the members yeah. to, to, to speak <laughs> about it and then he spoke up for the first time he gave back the money to uh, Mats the father of Kevin yeah and and he and he and he opened up and speaking out the truth yeah and after and after he was kicked by all the other guys uh, and, and knocked uh, in hospital yeah uh, and then and then Maya came to the hospital to visit him and that's where they actually. Well, connected, connected. Yeah, yeah. connected. Yeah, but but I still don't get why why you would, would make the choice not to have. Uh, I think it uh, would. Why? Have, no. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I think it maybe, would have maybe added. more more suspense because now maybe yeah. yeah. Although I would find it interesting if I knew already that Benji knows, and if I already know that Ahmed knows, that would give me much more like you know under the skin, so to say, like okay, what's gonna happen? Who's gonna who's gonna speak up? Who's gonna talk? What's gonna happen between Kevin and 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 Benji? Yeah, Something it, that's it, also it, a bit less ten, developed. Ten minutes, yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah. that's another thing. Kevin and Benji, uh, they are almost towards the very end of the series. They are still friends until that moment when Ahmad steps up when he walks out, Benji. Yeah. But here it's already right after, well, he saw uh, Maya outside, then he knows what happened. And from that moment on, more or less, they get, he gets into a fight with Kevin and they're not friends anymore. Um, so there was also a difference. A lot, a lot of changes, to be honest. Yeah. yeah. And one, one I also found quite a weird difference is that that meeting, that voting uh, moment where, where what you talked about, Sven, in the clubhouse. In this, in this scene, we see Kevin sitting there. We see Maya sitting there. We see the mother of Maya sitting there, and we see Peter sitting here. While in the book, Kevin is not there, Maya is not there, Mira is not there, and Peter only briefly walks in to quickly walks, walk out again. And okay. I found when I saw that scene, like, isn't that a bit weird after all that happened that they're just sitting there all in this yeah, small room yeah, together? Yeah. And now I read the book, and it's not actually happening there. So that makes me even more feel like, yeah, why, why did they do that? Yeah, it was it's it was it was quite uh, a court uh, yeah. feeling they created, and I think they had to do it because of the time, because they could now uh, combine a lot of uh, open storylines uh, together. Just yeah. everybody's yeah. there, yeah. and then they talk it through, and then you know we're quickly yeah. are done with uh, finishing the story. So because there, uh, uh, the father of Maya could uh, show he stands behind his daughter again. So the the mother and 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 the daughter were uh, again uh, happy with the father. Uh, it was the moment where Ahmad could speak up. It was the moment where uh, others, uh, like the club board, uh, lost trust or confidence in Mats. It yeah. was like all these things that were open yeah. could be. Yeah. It, I think it was a matter of time. He didn't have to add enough time, so he but added everybody there. I, I agree. I think also that's why I did it, but. But it's I don't weird, find it. Mean? I don't find it very believable that if yeah, if this just yeah. happened, that the, that Maya would sit quietly, Kevin would sit, yeah. especially her mother, who has been very fierce yeah. the whole series, that, that that nothing would happen. They just sit there and wait out. Yeah, happens. Was way too amicable. Oh, was, yeah. I, yeah. I I digested it quiet, like uh, without any protests, inner right. protests. Actually, yeah. I I could I could uh, dig it, but uh, yeah. you Kun? Yeah, it seemed too amicable uh, amongst each other just to sit there. Especially yeah. also it was weird that that was a, there was a moment that uh, 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 when Maya walked in, that her parents were like, "You shouldn't be here. You sure you want to be here?" You know, in that sense. Uh, um, and it was weird that that yeah, that uh, Kevin was sitting there. But it also reminded me a little bit of the way they handled, of course, uh, at the police station. That also both families were uh, uh, pulled in at the same time, which is, I think, yeah. in no police matter done. It just doesn't happen like this, I think. Oh, well. I don't know how it works in a small town like this, of course. But Yeah, uh, but there yeah, are protocols. Okay. Yeah, you never know, yeah, of course. But yeah. Also in America, with small towns, the police, there's always a lot of yeah. bad stuff going on. But yeah, yeah, it was a bit strange. But what Sven said, I, I, I think it was because of time. And, yeah. and uh, But it's very strange to hear now, like... I was okay with the show, but if I hear these changes, I'm like, why? You know, like yeah, there's also some, some, some I can live with and I can explain, and I think like okay, yeah. but some are quite crucial, I think. But to touch on a bit more uh, differences, 
which create, creates a bit of, bit of extra drama is that Peter, before he gets to know, uh, he hears what happens to uh, Kevin, what Kevin, Kevin did to his, to his daughter, he gets a call from an old NHL colleague who tells him that they want to draft uh, Kevin. Of uh, course. So that, uh, of course uh, and they also talk about that NHL is very critical about what happens also in someone's private life and blah, blah, blah. So well, we know that that probably then fall, fell through later on. Um, we already touched on it in the review. In the series, we see how Peter doubts Maya's story for a brief moment. Mm -hmm. Well, this doesn't happen in the book. Then furthermore, we got towards the end when Maya points the gun at Kevin. She decides to walk away without saying anything. While in the book, and I think in the book, that, yeah, I think that was quite a powerful uh, line. I was waiting for it for her to say. In the, okay. in, in the book, she said, when she walked away, from now on, you will also be afraid of the dark, Kevin, for the rest of your life. And that's when she walked off. Um, in the end, uh, in the very end of the book, they make a little ch ch uh, time jump into the future. And then we hear the story about how Maya has become a successful pop star uh, touring, uh, touring the world. And she returns to Bjornstad to perform in the stadium. Oh, no. Uh, yeah. And uh, she runs into Kevin and his wife. Uh, his wife who's, who's pregnant and she could tell his wife everything but she realizes she has all power over him and decides to let him off the hook know, knowing that 10 years later he still <laughs> sleeps with the light on when Kevin drives off trembling and sweating his wife asks him who the woman was and Kevin tells her the whole truth um Wow. Then one more thing we had in the book, they talk about Ahmad, Zacharias, Bobo and Benjamin. And, they, and he's, they say that in 10 years, two of them will be professional, one a father and one dad. So oh, that was God. quite like, okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so if we have to make a prediction, guys, of Ahmad, Zacharias, Bobo and Benjamin, two professional, one a father and one dad, which one would be that? <laughs> Ahmed will become father. Yeah, not a professional. He was, of course, the most talented. I think Ahmed oh, and Benji yeah. will be professional, I think. Who was the third one? Uh, Zacharias, that's the friend of Ahmad. Oh, and yeah. you got uh, Bobo, the, the, the bit... Uh, okay. Yeah, Bobo is dead. Uh, uh, the, the, yeah, I think the, so, too. Uh, Bobo, was, Bobo was the, the big aggressive the, guy, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Who became friends with Ahmad later on a bit, yeah. Yeah. I yeah, think so Bobo, Bobo died. Yeah, I yeah. think so too. Yeah. Second year's father and the other two. Second year's father. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Well, maybe we'll we find out in the in the second book, which I haven't uh, read yet, but I think it's a standalone, so I'm not sure. But maybe they make a little okay. Easter egg uh, there. Who knows? But yeah, those are uh, basically the, the the most big changes. Of course, there's a lot more to it, but mm -hmm. those are the the changes between the book and the and the series. What do you think, guys? If you hear this all. Yeah, I'm just thinking that uh, I, I, I'm thinking of reading the book now more, and I'm thinking yeah, like there. I think too many changes made, so that's a bit strange to yeah, me, to be honest. Yeah, was yeah. was the, the writer in any way? The, uh, uh, no, no, not involved. No, I, I follow him on the social media, and already made yeah. a post like uh, he's he just wants to concentrate on the writing, and his management handles this all kinds of things, and okay. uh, so yeah, uh, maybe he did some consultancy that might be, but he's not involved with writing the script or anything. Okay. Uh, so uh, the makers had the free free choice for, for that matter. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think the, the the it's hard to compare because um, five episodes of an hour, uh, fifty minutes. And, and a book of many pages. Yeah, yeah. It's, it, it's always hard uh, to compare. I think that um, we already discussed in a review that we we were not that enthusiastic about some decisions the director made. Yeah. Uh, and of course, there were what I hear about now, especially the the pivotal scene. The, yeah, the event yeah. scene where yeah, where, yeah. where where Maya's being raped. I think yeah. that yeah. that scene yeah. could have been. Yeah, he decided to to yeah. go for suspense, maybe. Uh, but uh, yeah, why actually? I agree. I yeah, think I agree. The, yeah. the suspense would have anyway have been there. I think so. And I think I think even more because then you are all the time like, okay, what's going to happen? Who's going to yeah, stand up? Is it Is it, Angie? Up is it exactly, yeah. is, exactly? So I think yeah. uh, I, I I don't really. That's that's also the other things I might okay I don't really get it but um, yeah okay I can get it but this mm -hmm. I really this is the, the the well the the event of the series and I, I don't yeah. get why why yeah. 
he made it like this. But uh, yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. Oh, True. Um, so yeah, those are the differences. In a different <coughs> video uh, later on, I will also give you some watch tips about what to watch later. Uh, after you watch Bear Town, there's many great Swedish series. I will give some uh, watch tips for that matter. But we're going to end this video now for the people uh, watching and that also read the book and seen the series. Uh, is there something we missed? Let us know in the comments. Either way, discuss with us in the comments about this series. Yes. Uh, we like to take this discussion further over there. Then we will end this video now. Guys, thank you for joining and hey, Bye-bye.